watch out, baby, you're about to tip the scale. The feather on the turtle's back broke the shell. Back then there was a time I thought we prevailed. Fast forward, present day, it ain't going well. Don't have time for loss, I gotta cut you off. Don't know what you've been on. Me, I'm right, so I'm gonna start the 200 day, not 200 day, 200 page reading challenge by reading Dance with Thieves. I started it a few days ago and it's actually pretty good. It's taken me a really long time to finish. I'm on page 192, so I'm gonna try to read. I'm gonna try to read 50 pages right now and then and then I'll read more later. So I'm still reading Dance of Thieves. I'm on page 262. So I read about 70 pages and um, it's taking me a long time to read. Me like 90 minutes to finish those 70 pages. Okay guys, I am currently laying in bed here on my stomach and i'm gonna start reading final offer um i ended up reading like 110 ish pages of dance of thieves and now i'm gonna read a little bit of final offer just to take a break because i like reading two books at once so it seems more interesting to like switch between two books then i just get bored of like one book like i feel like i'm not progressing in either so yeah i'm gonna start reading the final offer and i'll probably read um the rest of my 100 pages or 90 pages from here <laughs> Since this is like a Kindle, I'm gonna count like one of these as one page. So, so 16 and 17 is one page, so. Okay, so I took a shower and I'm still over here <laughs> and I ate lunch and I'm still reading the final offer. I'm on page 134 or divided by two, you do the math. But um, I'm gonna go until 200, that makes sense. That's like 100 pages about. So 100 pages up here and 100 pages from dancing. So I'm gonna read now. Okay guys, I finally made it to 200, meaning that I finished the challenge, challenge for today, and um, my hair's a little crazy, so I just washed it, but um, I kind of want a book journal right now, <laughs> so I think I'm gonna like print out a few pictures with them in my journal and like make a summer like TBR, so I'm just like turning into a booktuber in this video, but like it's so much fun. Okay guys, it's Monday morning and I actually read a lot more than um, 200 pages yesterday, but today um, I'm more crunched for time, so I'm definitely going to start reading right now. I'm on page 365 for Dance of Thieves, and I think I could finish it today or tomorrow, and then I'm going to read more of the final off too. So I'm going to make pancakes and I'm going to read that while I make them, so yeah. I had I read about like 50 pages in the morning, so 150 pages to go and 90 pages of this book left. So I think that I'm gonna bring something else because I don't want to bring my iPad. Cherry picking, I'm gonna pick up and but I'll show you guys that after I finish this one. So be life in the hills, it ain't all bad. Wait by the phone till you call back. Drove to the beach with the top back. Okay, I just finished reading um, Dance of Thieves. It was a solid four stars, like 4.25. It didn't hit the five star mark because if it was five stars, I wouldn't be able to put it down. But it was definitely really good. And I'm definitely going to be reading um, the second book right over here. I'll probably go maybe to Barnes and Noble on Wednesday. But I am going on Saturday too. But I kind of want to go. But yeah, so now I'm going to read the final offer. It's 8.04 p.m. I ended up having a really long day and um and i'm not being able to finish this like while i was like driving because like, while my dad was driving for cherry picking because i fell asleep like i always do but now i'm gonna read um the final offer i still have 60 pages left so i think that's the amount before i go to bed um so i'm gonna read on my ipad so yeah that's the update for today and yeah I just made it to page 217, so that marks my 200 pages, and I'm so tired right now, and I don't know if I love this book, it's kind of, um, okay, it's kind of predictable too, but the characters are unique, so that's good, but I just want to finish it, I'm probably going to end up finishing it tomorrow, or der. I've been like finishing books like this, like, <laughs> so quickly, but yeah, okay, I will see you guys tomorrow for another reading update. Okay guys, I just got back, and I read about 50 pages in 
school but today we're just like signing yearbooks and stuff so i didn't really have that much time to read but i'm gonna read i'm gonna i'm probably gonna finish the final offer right now and then i'll probably read meet me on the lake by carly fortune after this so yeah i'm gonna read now Okay, I finished reading and I'm just like in bed. I have such bad allergies right now, but this reading and um and um I have about 50 more pages, left 100 pages. So I'm gonna I'm gonna like watch a book recommendation video because like I don't know if I really like this book. It's kind of like dragging. And I didn't feel like reading it, so I think I'm gonna read a book recommendation video and then I read my rest of my pages of like a fast-paced book. I ended up starting Consider Me, and I don't know if I like it yet, but I'll keep you up to date. Update. I finished my 50 pages, so I'm gonna stop right over here. Okay, it's the next day, and I'm gonna read The Inheritance Game. I thought I was gonna read a Meet Me by the Lake, but honestly, I'm kind of craving something other than a romance. So I'm gonna read The Inheritance Games now, and I heard that it's really good. And I actually got this for Secret Santa during winter. So I've been. This has been. This has been on my physical TBR for a long time. So I'm ready to read it, and. And it says in the front that Barnes is a master of puzzles and plot twists and heritage game was the most fun I've had all year and, and then also it says impossible to put down by BuzzFeed so it better be good I really need something good because like I feel like this video is going to be this challenge and people put me in a reading slump if I don't read something that's like a five star read so I'm going to read Jennifer Lynn Barnes and also like I'm just going to DNF like do not finish the um what is it consider me consider me because like I already know where it's going to go and I know I'm I know I'm not going to like it so I'm just gonna go ahead and read the inheritance games and I'll give you guys an update once I'm like a hundred pages in and if I like it maybe when I go to Barnes on Saturday I'll get the next book which is the Hawthorne legacy so yeah <laughs> I'm in my chair right now, so that's why I have a little bit of a list. But I think I made a really good choice using the inheritance games to read because it's so easy to read. Like I'm already on page 127, and I also read reread a little bit of Vicious, which is like one of my favorite books ever. Like the Sinners of Saint series by Audrey Shen. Like I think my Audrey Shen is so good. And if you like like a more of like a dark romance, like oh my god, it's so good. And then um, I think I'm gonna um, read like 40 more pages of inheritance games to reach my 200 page goal i'm pretty sure i've re read more of the dishes but just to be safe i'm gonna read 40 more pages of this and then or more and then call it a day so yeah The book is really good. The chapters are short, which I always love, and um, and also like it's about this girl. Um, she's just like a really smart girl, and then there's this family called the Hawthorns, and they um their grandpa died, and um she inherits so much of his money, and like it's basically just like boring that, and it's really interesting. It's kind of like a mystery, but I think there's also a little bit of romance I'm like detecting. So yeah. Okay, oh, yeah, guys, I'm from my little like book corner, and today's been quite the a busy day but i'm gonna make time to read right now um i'm gonna continue reading the inheritance game and i actually got up to page 180 yesterday so yeah i'm gonna read now and then for about like 30 ish minutes and then i'll try i'll read like after i get back from my interview so yeah Okay, so I was called for my interview a little bit early, so then I only got through like 20 pages of um, the book. So yeah, <laughs> there's no way I'm gonna read um 180 pages tonight. So I'm just gonna try to read 80 pages and then call it a day. Yeah, I already failed this challenge, but we're just gonna continue with the 200 pages tomorrow. Cause today I went out to dinner and I had the interview, so it didn't work out. <laughs> today was a busy day, but I will still do the 100 pages. So yeah, anything is better than nothing. And and I'll check in with you guys tomorrow. Okay guys, I did not read the 80 pages yesterday. I'd be tired, but I ended up reading a lot today. I'm currently on page, where am I? Page 295, so about 80 pages now. Okay, so I have 120 pages. I think I'm gonna finish it today, and it's really good. And I tried to find the other book at Target today, but I couldn't find it. So maybe I'll get it tomorrow, because I'm going to Barnes & Noble tomorrow, so yeah. I don't know why she got me feeling this way. She's got a way. Guys, 
guys, this book is so crazy. There's like so many plot twists. It's really good, but like I'm just like confused what the next book is gonna be about. And like I feel like there's gonna be a cliffhanger. And like I have like this much left, so I'm gonna read it. And I think there's gonna be a cliffhanger at the end. And I was right. There was a cliffhanger at the end of this. And there's no way that I'll be able to read any other, like start any other book. But I still have like about 40 more pages for my reading challenge. So I think I'm just going to reread a book because I don't, I don't want to start any other book than the Hawthorne Legacy. So I'll be getting that tomorrow at Friends and Noble. Okay, it's the next day. It's Saturday and day and I just made it to Friends and Noble. So let's go get the Hawthorne Legacy. And I kind of like the idea of like coming back to Friends and Noble to like get a new book and just get like one book instead of like a ton of books so I can keep on coming back. So I'm just gonna buy one book. Yeah, I'm just gonna buy one book. <laughs> okay, wait, no, it's not gonna work. Okay, I just got the Hawthorne Legacy and I'm so excited to start reading it. I'm so start reading it tonight and I'll probably start reading it get back so i'm gonna go drive home right now it is a lot later and i'm only 54 pages and i don't think i'll be reading 200 pages but i'm gonna try i ended up coming back from my thing and then taking a really long nap really fat nap <laughs> and then after that i just decorated the car because i'm graduating in like two days three days and then I read for a little bit and then yeah now I'm gonna read more so hopefully I can <laughs> finish some more and then today is the last day of the challenge and if I don't make it to 200 pages today then I only really read 200 pages for five days but mm, it's okay because like I guess like on the days I did read more than 200 pages I guess that kind of like rolls over but like we're, I'm gonna try to read 200 pages because it's the last day mm -hmm. 